With the variety and complexity of tool tethers, we feel that good instructions need to be incorporated with the tool. And the ANSI standards suggest that proper instructions need to be with the tool tethers. For example, a lot of times the most common tether like this is found hanging in a store with no instructions at all. Now, if I'm attaching it just to a D-ring like this, it's pretty obvious how to loop and cinch it around there. But what if I'm attaching this to a hammer that doesn't have an attachment point? If I'm looping and cinching it, it really needs to be also taped. All that information needs to be incorporated with the product to tell you how to properly instruct it. So many times we go to a job site and we see improper tool attachments. So if the tool attachments are not being done properly, you do not have a safe system.